Greetings everyone, here's Lordic again, and this is a game one, the Pacific Advance Edition. This is my play by email match against Azuro, PCLI Commander for me, this is the Empire of Japan. This is scenario 50 and game version 26B on extended map with stacking limits. 7th February 42, and I slowly but steadily uh, take every day one or two more new bases from the Allies. Yesterday there was a heavy bombardment at Suva and uh, my own reinforcements arriving there. First the Allied ship is sinking, I don't know where, but at least the S-boat is failing to hit my cow ship. That is good. And I get finally some hits on this S-boat. Maybe it will sink. Well, not now. A British submarine trying to intercept my shipping at uh, Singapore. I think it was able to score and sunk one of my better cargo ships some days ago. And I still find this small harbor patrol ships in the port of Surabaya. I get rid of two of them. Now I make a strike at Darwin. To be suppress the uh, enemy ground forces. Normally this is not the style I like to use carry aircraft for ground attacks, but the allies are so weak that I maybe can do it and I fly in 15,000 feet to avoid 90% of the flick. This are my super long range torpedo boats and we have here Queen Elizabeth. Oh, but we miss it. Pity. This would be a big, big ship to sink. You cannot be successful every day. But uh, Azurop is using very heavy APs at the front line to reinforce his positions. And now this is the Eastern Landing Force Zone. But I have also here local cap. I'm not sure if it's land cap or carrier cap. And the Dutch Air Force is so weak that you know, this is nothing more call or would be a threat for me. Sweep is a little late. And yeah, there's one car which I've left, but it's burning. So afternoon strike, maybe now. Queen Elizabeth is still here. One torpedo hit, two torpedo hits, three. And the escort destroyer hit, also double torpedo hit, or even triple. And number four, number five, number six. And all both going down immediately. But a little too late. It was nearly empty. The unloading was just finished and then I sunk them both. Uh, of course, Queen Elizabeth, I think, is the biggest AP on the map. That is uh, value like a heavy cruiser. Yeah. Here I fly also 15,000, but still a flag hit with kit. And the allies using their air power to suppress my ground forces. And some small tankers on the other side, south side of Java, trying maybe to smuggle out some fuel. 
but this Paula tanker is no more. And my carriers are also striking out, and I find some light cruiser. But I score no hit. Yeah, I consume all my luck with uh, Queen Elizabeth. Pity. So now two Vindicators, one try the impossible, attacking my carriers. Of course I did. Here at Buna, there's still some allied units, maybe the leftover troops from, uh, from Moresby. Taking the dot base. And trying to also overcome here this next Chinese block army. But they're looking a little strong, and he is also similar to other hex. I cannot bring here too much attack power in this hex. And yeah, this battle is maybe a victory for China. Not really that I get destroyed, but I have a whole regiment disabled. So I try it uh, east of uh, Shangsha. Uh, acceptable, but not really win for me. So the next battle for Batan. Long time no see more. But yeah, it's okay. It's okay, but uh, not really. Again. Nothing really I can call a win. And the bombardment, it, uh, uh, yeah, not great, not bad, but uh, the allied attack power is coming back, that for sure. Uh, and I was able to sunk, uh, uh, sink just now. Uh, Queen Elizabeth, but too late, the forces are all unloaded, pity. And here you can see, yeah, this is I think what is left from Port Mosby. Yeah. There was a possibility to sink even more allied warships, but uh, don't be too greedy. Uh, and sinking APs is never bad. Because I think at least in 42, the allies have only limited numbers and capacity of AP. And 43, maybe it doesn't matter more. Good. So, air losses are light still. Nothing really too special happened. I lost one pilot, okay. But the good news is that uh, Queen Elizabeth is 71 points, victory points. I mean, Points are only points at the end, but uh, you get here a cruise speed of 28, what is I think, 6 or 7 hexes per pulse. So you can really move a l heavy stuff fast around. So this is maybe, uh, I don't know, half regiment or even a full regiment you can get on this ship. And now it's dead. Yeah, it is good. And Additionally, I get also this uh, French good destroyer, the 2000 ton destroyer. Mm. Yeah. And the rest is not so important. The power is, yeah, the submarine I think was still alive. I think a small, doesn't matter. Yeah. So in China, I had two battles, both I was not able to really win. Yeah. 
another day. I was able to take over the dot base and he's a mine, there's no one, so a lot of resources again for me without damage. Uh, I have now the situation or the issue that my paratroopers I uh, was able to hold the hex, but I don't know for long. I have uh, some equipment, but I don't really have enough supplies and I have still very high disruption, so I don't know if Azurob attacking me here maybe soon. I have no option to retreat because I'm inside the hex, I have all the closed borders are closed. So I must more or less bring forces outside to read to open the hex here. Or I must drop so many paratroopers inside the hex that uh, I can win the battle. But uh, this is unlikely. Darwin, I think more forces are ready to prepare. I know this is still only my carriers. He's trying to give air support. And I have a bombardment task force is coming. Oh, yeah. So I use my heavy cruisers to try to bombard the allies and then attack them. Maybe this will be enough to take the base. Once I have the base, everything else is maybe much smoother and easier. Here at Fiji, I had the win and lose at the same time, so I was not able to attack this really task force here, Source East, but there was the other one at Suva. Uh, yeah, so, missed opportunity, but still success. I had here only two carriers, and uh, not more too many aircraft left to really fly out. Yeah. But uh, the number one goal is normally bring the reinforcements to Nadi and then to Suva to hold the position. That is most important for me. Good. And see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.